Hey y'all, so I gotta start this video off. Thank you guys for subscribing to the channel. It really means a lot. Uh, today we have Larry's project car that is basically in the same situation that we left it before. Um, I kind of uh, wanted to take on this project even though it's not my project, it was Larry's project, but I was gonna help him, you know, throughout the way so he can finish uh, his car. But unfortunately, Larry has gotten another car, which is a daily driver, and he cannot continue with this project. So I'm stuck with the two projects that I have going on, my Celica and the 81 Civic. So right now, I had to reach out to a friend of mine and uh, he's gonna actually give me a hand uh, finishing this project. The project will be completed. I'm not a quitter. I know Larry isn't a quitter as well. He's actually working hard. He got a uh, job and you know, he's taking care of, he's being a responsible young adult. So he decided he doesn't wanna continue uh, investing in this project. So me as a dad, I'm gonna help him out and I'm gonna see if I can finish this for him. So I've got in a, a friend of mine that's gonna help me out and he says he's, he's willing to take on the project, he's gonna help me out. Uh, I'm gonna probably, you know, drive out there every now and then to check it and see if he needs help with anything. But uh, my friend Eric, Eric Guillem from uh, Guillem Performance, I'm gonna link his information in the, in the video so you guys can have it in case you guys are in the area and you need uh, somebody to help you out with a project, that's all he does, he, all he does is project car. So right now I'm trying to clean the car up, make sure that I take all of the stuff that, are, that, do not, that does not belong to this project. And um, here, let me show you guys. So I went ahead and removed all the stuff that we didn't need. Some of, them is, some of it is over there, some of it is on top of the, the car, which ain't much, everything else, belongs to the car uh, it's either new parts or sorry parts from the 95 or parts from the 81 so everything is mixed it's kind of organized it looks like a mess but everything's organized um, have a bunch of uh, screws in there and uh, everything's backed up a bunch of stuff that we worked on since out of that red bag um, we got the dash and uh, the plastics, some of the plastics, the shift linkage, there's one here, there's one on the other side. I left space for the e-brake because I have to push the car out on the driveway. So I have to push this car back, kind of kick the wheels as I go, kind of go and kick the wheels to turn it and get it outside so that the tow truck can come and grab it. So that's what I'm doing right now, guys. Let me start getting this car out of this garage so we can take it to Guillen Performance. You're gonna help us out with this build. We're not quitting on it yet, guys. Still gonna work on it. All right, so I got it as close as I could to the gate. So I got it as close as I could to the gate. And I'm waiting for the tow truck to arrive. And then we just gotta push it out and load it up. It's coming at six. So hopefully it's not too dark, but it was a pain in the butt, a pain in the butt because 
The sway bar, I don't know if it's a stabilizer bar or a sway bar is, is not hooked up. As you guys can see. So it's not hooked up. There or there. So it's basically rolling on the on the shocks and the controller. I think it's a controller. But yeah, we made it. Thanks to my neighbor came and helped me out. Saw me having a hard time. So yeah. We'll come back when the tow truck is here so we can load it up. Next time you'll see this car is gonna be running. There you go. Some wood sleds, that was interesting. Yeah. Never seen that before. Si sí, es lo que me estaba contando, ya lo fue a traer usted allá.